three, two, one. Hi guys, so I'm going to show you um, what's in my fidget box. So let's start with the biggest. This is like my squeeze mall. Um, it's kind of like a squishy, but like coated in like fabric, if that makes sense. Um, it's okay, um, although it's quite big. It smells amazing though, so I would give it a eight out of ten. What's that noise? Um, and then we've got my Rubik's cube, which is actually all nice and um, what's the word? Nice and organized. <laughs> I don't know. Um, it, it's not like all messed up. Like it's not like that. Oh, there we go. It kind of stresses me out a bit more, I think, because I um, can't fix it. I find it really hard to fix, so when I mess it up, I, it just stresses me out even more. So I'd give this one a 7 out of 10. And then this one, yeah, I feel like it was really popular, like maybe 2019 or something. Um, but I got one of these, and I don't mind it. I think it's quite cool. Um, although it's really, really cold when it goes in your arms and stuff, so I would give this a six, just because it's not that great. And then I've got my snake from Smiggles. Um, also I forgot to say where these are from. This one's from Claire's. Um, this one's from The Entertainer. I have no clue where this is from, so. <laughs> um, but I know you can get them on Amazon and stuff, and same with, I think, everything in here. Um, but this one I got from Smiggle. And, yeah, I don't mind it, but like the Rubik's Cube, it stresses me out when it's not in this shape. I don't know why, it just... <laughs> um, so I'll give that a... I'll give it an 8, because I do quite like it, it's quite nice to feel around with. Is that swelling? Okay, it's gone. Oops. Okay. Um, and then I've got this, which I don't even know why I put in here. It's a bit weird. It's not really a fidget toy, but I don't know. It's soft. It's kind of cute. Um, yeah. <laughs> um, it, on camera it looks like orange, but it's really like a bright, bright pink. So it's like it's not focusing properly. Yeah, it's a super bright pink on camera. <laughs> Off camera real life <laughs> so yeah i'll give this a um, six out of ten because it doesn't really do much um and then i've got this which i feel like is absolutely rubbish but i don't want to bin it just because <laughs> just because um so what it is it's thing off the top of the bag i don't know whether you guys can see it properly but it's kind of like what do you like call it? Like you know the ziplock bags, basically these but top that. Um, obviously I just got it from a plastic bag. <laughs> it's nothing special really, but it's quite nice to go like that, I suppose. Um, but yeah, five out of ten does nothing. <laughs> um, and then we've got this one. This is my flower stress ball, which I actually really like. I don't know if you guys can see that, but um. Yeah, so it's basically two teaspoons of flour um, wrapped up in cling film and then it's super soft and then just to make sure that if so the first layer pops it doesn't go everywhere um, you put another layer over the top and that's kind of what makes a crunchy sound like so yeah I do quite like this one it feels nice um, yeah, I've done. it's just quite noisy Next one, let's do my tangle, you know, it's pretty, although the other day um, it wasn't very good because this part broke off and got stuck in this part, so then I had to um, take them apart and now it's shorter, it's not as long as it used to be, so it's kind of sad, um, but yeah, I love these, um, 9 out of 10, it's just I couldn't have them at school or anything because they're really super noisy. Um, yeah. Okay, and then we've got my proper. Wait. Yeah, no, my other one's downstairs. 
Um, I have like four of these. Five. Because <laughs> I've got um, a pink one, yellow one, purple one, rainbow one, and a green one. Um, they're my proper mesh and marbles. They're the ones that I actually bought from Amazon. Yeah, I've got, yeah, this one, I think was Amazon. And obviously, this one's homemade. That, um, I literally don't even know where I got it. Like, I think you can get them from, like, fairs and stuff. They're just rubbish things. Oh, no, I do know where I got it, actually. I got it, um, at this farm shop kind of place. They just had, like, a little toy shop. I got it when I was quite young, actually. Um, but these mesh marbles, you get them off Amazon. Um, yeah, they're really nice to play with. I give them a 10 out of 10 because they're, like, really, really good. Um, like, I can take them to school. I can play with them, you know, in the classroom and stuff. And then I've got my homemade mesh and marbles, which I have got quite a few of. This is, like, not even a quarter of um, how many I've made. I just love making them, really. And so how you make them is get cut a scrunchie in half and then take the elastic out, tie one end up, put a marble inside, tie the other end up, cut off like the kind of parts there, and then you've got it. Um, I would give these single ones a 10 out of 10 because they're just like the other ones. Um, but the ones where it has more than one marble in, they're really noisy. So, although they're still really nice to play with. So I would give these a 9. And so, yeah, those ones are off of Amazon, and then the other ones I've made. Um, and then we've got this, which is actually just a hair tie. But I like to do this on my finger. I don't know why. It's just really relaxing. And I know you can buy them off of Amazon. Um, but, like, I've heard reviews saying that they hurt, but this doesn't hurt. So that's... You can, like, keep them on your wrists and everything as well. So in the classroom, that's really good. Um, I would give these... Um, 7 out of 10, just because they don't really do much anyway. Um, but yeah, so, literally just a hair tie. And then, this rubber ball doesn't really do much, like the other one. Although you can, like, chuck it up and down and stuff. But I just put it in here anyway, because that's really loud. <laughs> um, just because, you know. Um, I would, like, I mean, you can roll it around your hands and everything. Um, I would give this... A the heck? Um, sorry. Um, I'll give these a six, I think. Yeah, that's people talking, sorry. Um I think I got this from you know kids about the ones where you like shoot it to the back and you get like a rubber ball. Yeah, I swear I got it from there. Um, but yeah, I thought that was rain, but it's actually just a win. Um, and then we've got my flippy chain, which, um, uh, <laughs> you can get them properly, um, off Amazon, but they're quite expensive, they're like £3 each, so I, um, literally got two key rings, put them together, and you've got one, like, it's so simple. I know the other ones, they do have, like, they have clips of some sort, I don't know what it is, um, but yeah, so I would give this one, like, I really like this one, I use it all the time, it is kind of noisy if you go like that, um, and if they kind of go together, but I think, um, in a noisy classroom you could kind of get away with it, um, so yeah, I would give this an, um, maybe 8 out of um, I would say 9 out of 10 actually, just because they're quite noisy, that's all. Um, yeah. And then, um, I've got my homemade tangle, which I know you can use pegs, but these are literally just paper clips and you put them together and then you've got a tangle. Um, this one's not very big, um, but I do really like this one. And, like, the, you take pegs apart, but, um, our pegs are really snap up. Um, I just thought this was so much easier because I had them anyway. Um, because I have them anyway. And yeah, it, it feels really nice actually. I use this quite a lot. I would give this a 9 out of 10. I could get away with this in the classroom as well. 
um, because it, it literally just looks like I've got some paper clips from the classroom and just put them together. So. And then, last but not least, my paper squishy, which um, I actually made this morning because I really wanted to figure out what they feel like and they actually feel really nice. So I made it with this design on. It's upside down. It basically says love on it. I don't know whether you can see that. But yeah, it's, it's really like, the lighting is really bad, but it says love, basically, L-O-V-E. -E. Even that, that looks like an upside down A. But it's got a heart inside, so I don't know if you can see that. One heart, two heart, three heart, and then, yeah, four heart. <laughs> so yeah, I really do like this, although I searched it up on TikTok, because I know loads of people do paper squishies on TikTok, and I was like, oh, I'll search it up and see, um, you know, like, kind of what's it like and how easy it is to make them. But people draw, like, um, skittles and stuff, and I was like, oh, I'm not that talented, I'm not a very talented drawer, so, yeah, I was just like, it's really hard. Um, so I literally just did this design. Um, the only problem with it is I wish I, because um, you fill it with uh, toilet roll, but I wish I did a bit more toilet roll because here there's like no kind of tissue, but here it's really like there's loads. So yeah, I don't really know what to do about that, but <laughs> it was quite easy to make. Um, I could not sneak this in the classroom because um, it's huge. I think it's good for kind of. I think it's quite good for taking somewhere because um, it's not actually that loud. Um, so I would give this a 9 out of 10 because it is quite satisfying as well. I mean, it's not like the proper squishy. I could have filled it up like really thick, but I didn't. Um, but yeah, it's, I mean, there is a big difference between that and that. But I mean, if you haven't felt that for a long time, this feels good. <laughs> so yeah, 9 out of 10. Um, but yeah, that's all in my fidget box. I'm hoping, um, I, well, I've asked for a few for Christmas, and they're like proper ones as well. So like proper versions of these. Um, a, another tangle. Uh, what else did I ask for? You know, like these kind of balls, and they have the um, like red button, the green button, the yellow button, the blue button, and then you kind of squeeze it, or like pop it, you know what I mean? Um, and then I also asked for a poppet, so the purple round poppets where you put your fingers in, so yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed, bye!